fact that it was spreading so fast and we didn't really know what was going to happen. And then, of course, like losing your stuff and not really knowing, you know, where you're going to go for the night. Luckily, I had someone that I could stay with. Um, if it weren't for them, I don't know where I would have ended up. Um, it's just It's just scary to see a big wildfire just kind of coming your way. And it's just not something I ever experienced before. We were actually going to go to Greece this summer, but there's a lot of wildfires there, so we, we didn't go to Greece because of the wildfires, and we came here and there's wildfires. Uh, but I mean, yeah, it's, uh, it's, we were closer to them here than they are. we are in Canada, though there's a lot there, we could smell like the air quality was similar to actually. Based on the uh, request for our visitors um, to leave Maui, we worked with the um, Department of Business, Economic Development, Tourism, and the Hawaii Convention Center. So if there's anyone that's traveling off of Maui to Oahu and do not have, was not able to get a hotel room, the, they can get lodging at the uh, convention center. Uh, we, we don't have any transportation laid out yet. We're working that logistics now, but if you can find your way to the convention center, uh, we can provide you shelter there until you get follow-on um, transportation out of the state of Hawaii.